Hey folks, welcome to Rally TV. I'm Rick Reyna. I'm with my beautiful <laughs> wife, Nettie Reyna. Welcome. We are on part four of Compassion for the End Times. You almost could say, Compassion made me do it. Yes. Compassion made me go. Uh -huh. Compassion made me share the good news. Yes. And this is what we've been talking about. Mm -hmm. Uh, like Nettie said, this is part four. I encourage you to go back and <laughs> watch part one, part two, part three. Yes. We're actually coming off the last series. Mm -hmm. What message should we be preaching now that we're in the last days? Mm. And Jesus said, just preach the good news. Exactly. Well, mm -hmm. then Jesus spoke to me later. He goes, but in order to preach the good news, you must be moved with compassion. Yes. Because sinners, they'll see, mm -hmm. they'll sense yeah. the love of God, that you really care for them, yeah. you're really trying to help them, or if it's done out of works, so you mm -hmm. got to be watchful mm -hmm. that yes. we're not sharing the good news out of works. And we talked a lot about yes. that in the last couple mm -hmm. of shows. Uh, yes. that you're not doing it just mm -hmm. uh, to become famous on your own. Mm -hmm. You're not trying to become a minister. Mm. Yeah. I remember my son Eric shared something with me years ago. He said, Dad, there's a lot of preachers who are not called to be pastors. Mm. I go, what do you mean, Eric? He says, well, it's in that. I never forget him saying that. He goes, mm. it's the famous thing to do right mm. now. This is maybe five or six years mm. ago. Like Eric, I said, Eric, what are you talking about? <laughs> he says, right now there's a big fad or mm. a big movement. A lot of people are trying to become like, I won't mm. say no names, okay. uh, tight jeans. Mm. Uh, uh, Try to be famous. <laughs> yeah, LA celebrities, <laughs> all of that stuff. Mm. What happens is people see that and say, well, I can do that. I'll, ju I'll just open up a church and I'll mm. be like super cool. Wow. I'll wear tight jeans. I'll put glasses on and I'll put a hat on, a trucker hat. And That's I'm like, scary. I I'm all that. <laughs> mm -mm. That's not compassion. No. That's trying to become uh, an influencer. Yes. And you got to be watchful because people see it. Yes. Or in the, in the name of Christ, even. Yeah. Trying to do it. You know, I, no. I, was, I was saying something on the last, I think the last show. I didn't, I don't think I finished the story. I, I just want to be, just be blunt, mm -hmm. you know. And I want to be watchful. I'm not like this, yes. all right. Mm -hmm. And I'll say this. There's been times in our ministry that I posted something Mm -hmm. And our office took it down. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. then I'll call the office and said, okay, what mm -hmm. was the reason why you took down my post? Mm -hmm. And the office, the edit, our editor would say, because it wasn't said right. Mm -hmm. Maybe I typed it. It wasn't said right. <laughs> and they'll say to me, the way you said it brought attention to you yes. and not to Jesus. I said, okay, right. thanks for doing mm -hmm. that. Now, mm -hmm. okay, we're talking about Sharing the love of God in these last days, the motive needs to be compassion. Now, yes. you know, there's a lot of pastors out there, Nettie, and I just want to help. And I even, I shared with you right now how my, how my office has taken mm -hmm. down some mm -hmm. post that didn't look right, seem right, maybe wasn't filled with compassion. There's a lot of pastors out there. You can tell these are made up mm -hmm. pictures. Mm -hmm. What, you're trying to draw attention to yourself? Mm -hmm. Are you that guy that always wants to take a selfie with somebody <laughs> and you don't even know those people, but you want to post it? Mm -hmm. Hey, I was with Shaquille O'Neal. I was with Pastor So-and-So. <laughs> you know, I, I went to a conference and I was hanging out with the pastor who put the conference on. Mm -hmm. And you took a selfie in the hallway and he didn't even know you, but <laughs> mm. you took the picture like you knew him mm. and you posted it and you, and everybody thinks you're buddy, buddy with the conference pastor. Mm. Was that compassion? Hey, I'm talking, I'm talking to myself. Mm -hmm. I don't want to be that guy. No. Mm -mm. You talked about influencers earlier. 
I don't want to be the one who's trying to draw attention to me. Mm -hmm. If it's exactly. not love, if it's not compassion, mm -hmm. Moving me to reach people, and you, man, this is a, yeah. a, you know, I'm just, I'm just trying to help. Lady. Yes, well, I'm looking at the scripture that you uh -huh. have. Yeah, let me say one more thing. To that. Yeah, let me re say one more thought and okay. read the scripture. I know this is where it's coming from. Mm -hmm. Every time you do something for God, do you have to have people taking pictures of you doing it? <laughs> it's, it's, it's called content. Mm -hmm. This is the the new fad. It's not new, but. Content for social media. Mm -hmm. Yes. You know, mm -hmm. hey, make sure when I preach, you take seven pictures because it <laughs> takes seven pictures. You get one good one. That's that's the rule of thumb. Yeah. Seven, one, seven, one. Yes. You get one picture. So yes. make sure you take 14 <laughs> so I can at least uh, have two. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And there you are preaching. <laughs> You know, yes, you know, yes. I'm about to have an altar call. Make sure you guys take pictures yes. and sh so I can post it later yes. that we had an altar call. Oh, yes. Jesus. <laughs> you know, I better stop. Yes. You know, and I understand content is very important because yeah, you want to give important. vision and you want to show. Yeah. But I think the moral of the story yes. here is, did compassion make you do it? Did you do the altar call? Because of compassion, yes. or did you do the altar call so you can have con yes. content? You know, I better stop and let her <laughs> help me out before uh -huh. I, before you guys get mad at me. Listen, yes. compassion mm -hmm. is 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 leading me to yes. help you because I I've been there before. Mm -hmm. I've been there. I have had our social media department take down things that I posted mm -hmm. because it was not being presented correctly. Amen. So, hey, mm -hmm. I've been guilty. Mm -hmm. but I don't want that. Mm -hmm. All right? So, Nettie, read the scripture. Okay, 1 Timothy yes. 4, 1 says, Now the Spirit speaketh, that's the Holy Spirit, expressly that in the latter times some shall depart from the faith, giving heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of devils. Okay. <laughs> How much time do we got? Let's talk about it a little bit. Mm -hmm. Can you read it again? I'll, 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 I'll talk as we okay. go. Now the Spirit speaketh expressly. So who's speaking, me or the Spirit? Spirit of God. Yeah. So I need you to listen to me. Don't get mad. Don't change the station. The mm -hmm. Spirit of the Lord is speaking to me and you. All right? Go Expressively. ahead. Expressively. Express quickly. Yes. That in the latter times... Okay, we're in the latter mm -hmm. times. We talked about high time. Mm -hmm. Listen, we're in the last days. The days of becoming an influencer, becoming a celebrity pastor is over. <laughs> take the tight jeans off. Take, you know, you know, I know, I know I'm joking, but we need to get the tension off the preacher yeah. and get it on the good news. Yes. Go ahead. Okay. That in the latter times, some shall depart from the faith. Okay, the faith meaning the gospel. What faith are you? Mm -hmm. You know, what's your faith? I'm a mm -hmm. Christian. Some will depart from the faith. Now that's a dangerous place why. to be. Okay. This is why. This is why. Giving heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of devils. Hmm. You want to talk about it? Want me to talk about it? Well, you need to be very watchful. Mm. What is seducing? What is motivating you? Mm -hmm. Compassion or seducing spirits? And seducing means tricking someone to do something by making it look very attractive. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. So that means we have to have our spiritual antennas up and radars so we are not persuaded another way. Let me tell you why? why. We're in the last days. Mm -hmm. Nettie, we need to read this scripture again. I need you to read that thought because mm -hmm. what, what you have on your page is not on my iPad. Read mm -hmm. it again. Read it in conjunction. You want me to read the scripture? Yes, then read. Uh -huh. Okay. Now the Spirit speaketh expressly that in the latter times... Some shall depart from the faith, giving heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of devils. Now, seducing means tricking someone to do something.
by making it look very attractive. Isn't that, isn't that how it's been? Mm -hmm. So many people are falling away from the faith because of spirits seducing them. Now that's also tricking them. That's also a form of that's a propaganda. Now, when you think of propaganda in many ways, propaganda is out there trying to seduce you to think a different way. Mm -hmm. Every and spiritually, we see it in wartime, we see it many times, but also just in your daily life. Mm. Maybe a coworker, maybe family members. If you that there's anything trying to seduce you, mm, mm. tricking you to go another way that might look attractive, be watchful. Wow. People of faith, even because it says people of faith, mm -hmm. some have departed from mm. the faith because of seducing spirits. Mm -hmm. So that's telling me you're in the faith. Listen, we'll be right back. Don't go nowhere. <laughs> it's getting good. Hello, everyone. We want to thank you for watching today's message. For more information about everything Rally Ministry, visit us at rallymin.org. Make sure you're staying connected with us through our social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, and X. There you will find information about upcoming events as well as many encouraging messages. If you're located in the Los Angeles area and you're looking for a place to build your faith, visit us at Rally LA. It's a monthly meeting where we have powerful worship, and a powerful message from Rick and Nettie Rayner. For more information about Rally LA, visit us at rallymen.org. Also, make sure to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Just search for Rally Ministry. There you will find current and past episodes of Rally TV. And finally, we have a podcast available on all podcast platforms. Just search for Rally Ministry to listen to an uplifting message from wherever you are. Now let's get back to the message. I'm telling you, Nettie, the Spirit of God is speaking expressly, meaning mm -hmm. like an express yes. quickly. Yes. And the reason mm -hmm. why, because we're in the latter times, mm -hmm. latter days. Yes, we are. It is very important that we give heed to the mm -hmm. Holy Spirit, not mm -hmm. to other spirits. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go back to the scripture. Please mm -hmm. read it again. Okay. 1 John 4, 1. Okay. I mean, Paul's right. It's 1 Timothy 4, 1. Okay, read it. Now the okay, Spirit... Now. <laughs> now. Now. Right now. Right now. Now the Spirit speaketh expressly that in the latter times some shall depart from the faith. Or not sharing their faith no more. Mm. Mm -hmm. See, we're talking about sharing our faith, mm -hmm. sharing the good news, Sharing the gospel because compassion makes us do it. Yes. Okay. But when we give heed to other spirits, it's no longer compassion. And because we have given heed to other spirits, guess what, Nettie? We're no longer sharing the faith. No. Nope. The good news. Mm -mm. Go ahead. I know you that's want to right. talk. No, that's fine. No. Go um, ahead. So that, the, that in the latter times, some shall depart from the faith giving heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of devils. So if you find yourself in a situation and you know the Holy Spirit ex is trying to speak expressly, quickly mm -hmm. through you to somebody, mm -hmm. be watchful with other spirits mm -hmm. that will try to stop you. Yes. Exactly. Because there's a war. The Bible says in Ephesians mm -hmm. chapter 6 mm -hmm. that there's other spirits, principalities, mm -hmm. and powers, mm -hmm. you know, and these things are warring against mm -hmm. us to hinder us and stop us yes. from sharing the good news. Fear, yes. anxiety. Well, I'm embarrassed. What if somebody, yeah. what if they reject me? Mm -hmm. Those are voices from yeah. the seducing spirits. Well, we also, we need to be watchful because... What if we're yielding to, not, not me in Jesus' name, what if Somewhere. anybody, someone's yielding, because mm -hmm. what if someone's yielding to these seducing spirits and starts following doctrines of devils mm. and the Lord comes back? And they're, and they're, and they're still following those devils. Mm -hmm. High rate of casualties, ladies yes. and gentlemen. 
Because we, we have to either be hot or cold. We can't be lukewarm. But it's, I like, it says in the latter times. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, we're in the latter days. Mm. And the gospel needs to be preached. Yes. But what's going to hinder the people of God mm -hmm. from preaching the gospel in the latter days? You ready? Yeah. Giving heed to seducing <laughs> spirits and doctrines of devil. Okay. Man, oh man, the So Holy don't Ghost. be one of those that mm -hmm. leaves your faith. No, stay in faith, stay connected to the Lord, stay in church, have a pastor, stay connected, don't heed to any other evil spirit. Stay in faith. One of your one of your famous lines that you say mm -hmm. is from a famous movie. Okay. I think the movie was called the Rally Movie. <laughs> oh, yes, what, it was. Okay. Yeah. One of my lines. One of your lines. That's not my lines. It's one of the act, talent, uh, okay. the talents. But you always say it. But yes, I it's do. It's in the movie, the rally. Yes. What do you say? I always say, in, in this house, we go to church. That's okay. a line. Why do you say that? Well, what does that mean? What does that mean? Well, the Bible says not to neglect assembling together. And it also says, as, as some have, Ooh. we need to stay in church. You're, mm. it, it's safe. Having a pastor is safe. Having a home church is safe. You're going to hear a word from the Lord. You're going to get sharpened when you go. And not only that, you have a supply for your pastor and for the church as well, mm. for those around you that'll keep you safe. You need to be in church. Your children need to, need to be in church. We did that. We do that. You have to be in church because some have stepped away and it's not good. Mm -hmm. It's not good. Some are so comfortable just watching church at home or maybe you just attend special meetings. That's great, but you have to have a home church. And in, in, in the... Oh, help me, Holy Spirit. I want to say the problem with that or the, the I, want to, I want to say it, mm -hmm. Holy Spirit. The problem with that or the danger with that okay. is you'll start giving heed to seducing yes. spirits. Yes, exactly. And well, again, there's safety when you're part of And the then church. some people will start obeying or listening to mm -hmm. doctrines of devils. Wow. Well, yeah. that all comes to... Departing from the faith mm -hmm. or departing from the good news. Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, there's a war going on. <laughs> do we preach the good news? Mm -hmm. And if we do, there'll be a high rate of salvation. Yes. A high rate of people getting saved. Mm -hmm. Or if we do not. Yeah. There'll be a high rate of casualties, simply meaning people dying. Yes. Yes. Without Jesus. Exactly. And we need to do our job. Like I said in previous um, episodes, get some cards. Get some cards from your church. Mm -hmm. Put them in your bag. Put them in your backpack, your purse, whatever. And invite people to church. Mm -hmm. It's time. People are hurting. People are sick. People are depressed. See, people are in fear. But we are the church, and so we need to compel them to come in. Mm. We need to invite them. Best way to do it is take a, a card from your church and say, hey, do you go to church? Again, they're going to say either, no, I haven't been to church in a long time, mm. or I never go to church, or some will say, oh, maybe I'll go. But it's important we do our part. Mm -hmm. And for us at Rally TV, Rally Ministry, mm. we have Rally TV cards. And the Lord instructed me, put some in your purse if, and tell people to go to church, first of all. But then if give them this card because they can hear a word mm -hmm. that can help them and save them and build them up in their faith and lead them to Jesus if they don't know Jesus. But we have to do our part. I want to give some instructions. Mm -hmm. There's three things that God said. All okay. right. Number one, pray for the lost. Mm -hmm. We need to do that. Yes. Number two, we need to share the good news to the lost. Mm -hmm. And number three, we need to get involved in winning the lost. All right. Yes. I, did, I didn't know I was going to share this, mm -hmm. but I want to share this. Next year in 2024, mm -hmm. Rally Ministry, we're going to do six mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Rally Californias. What's a Rally California? Mm -hmm. We just did an event called Rally California. 
we had close to, I think it was like 18 different churches came together. Mm -hmm. We had close to a thousand people show up. A one night event where we mm -hmm. preached the gospel, people got saved. Yes. We prayed for the sick, people got healed. Mm -hmm. And then we speak the blessing over California. Yes. Then God spoke to us on the stage at the event. Mm -hmm. He said, Rick, next year in 2024, I want you to do six of them. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is what I'm gonna say. It is time to get up mm -hmm. and start preaching the gospel. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna help you. <laughs> you can join us. Mm -hmm. You can become a part of this team. Listen, we've been working on this every day. I'm about to send out a letter, but I'm gonna tell you guys something firsthand. You can go to rap, you can go to info at rally. Help me, is it rally <laughs> for Christ? Yes. Producer, is it rally yeah. for Christ or rally info? It'll be on the screen. It's yeah, below it'll you. be on the bottom <laughs> of the screen. You can email it Amen. and say, I want to be a part of this. Go to rallymen.org. And you can write there. Yes, go Rally to rallymen.org mm -hmm. and submit an email. Mm -hmm. Simply say, I want to be a part of this team. Yeah. Amen. Listen, we'll take you. Mm -hmm. We'll take you and we'll let you help us preach the good news mm -hmm. of Jesus Christ. It Amen. is high time. Mm -hmm. What's high time? It's the 10 seconds before a blast off. Mm -hmm. And I'm telling you, we're about to blast off in yes. this place. With, we're in the within the 10 seconds. <laughs> Go to rallymen.org mm -hmm. and let us know you want to. And listen, there's three ways you can get involved. Number yeah. one, pray mm -hmm. for Rally California. That's right. Number two, you can volunteer. You can come and help us. Mm -hmm. And number three, mm -hmm. you can sow a financial seed. Exactly. I'm telling you, God mm -hmm. is but, speaking but to us. But why? Because compassion. compassion <laughs> That's the only reason why we're doing what we're doing. Because yeah. compassion makes us do it mm. compassion tells us compassion tells us to go and compassion tells us to preach the good news yes now i i know i said this kind of in a joke earlier we can we can sit down and just watch tv all day long mm -hmm. we can go we live in california sunny california let mm -hmm. me tell you the sun's out every day mm -hmm. we can go to the beach huntington mm -hmm. beach and <laughs> lay out in the sand uh -huh. why go preach jesus mm -hmm. forget that no compassion yeah stirs us up yes. listen folks we love you here mm -hmm. at rally ministry mm -hmm. right here at rally tv we love you so much and we're yes. praying the blessing over you uh -huh. we want to encourage you well that sums up part mm -hmm. four yes. well, let's see if we continue i think we might continue <laughs> next. all right we love you guys we'll see you next time mm -hmm. on rally tv you know Every single time we get to do Rally TV, Nettie, my heart rejoices. Uh -huh. I'm going to tell you why. We got, well, I got a text the other day from somebody. Yes. It was a man that we met. I met him at a conference and, you know, he just wanted to become my friend. We talked, we exchanged numbers. Mm -hmm. Well, he texted me the other day and he was hunting with his son, <laughs> all right? And while he was hunting with his son, the enemy was trying to discourage him about his business, mm. about his finances, and about just life itself. Okay. Well, after they got, got done hunting, he went into his truck, I'm not sure, to go to his hotel or something, and he said, I need to be <laughs> encouraged. So he turned on the Victory Channel. Yeah. He turned on Christian TV. Okay. And we were on. <laughs> Rally TV was on. Oh. He said he heard the message about total freedom. Amen. And he said that God <clears throat> ministered to him. God brought life to him, encouragement to him, Nettie, yes. on total freedom. Amen. His life was touched. <laughs> he, he got excited. He was telling his son. His whole day turned around. Amen. He heard words that defeated discouragement. It Amen. defeated the enemy that was trying to lie to him. Yes. All because of Rally TV. Yes. And then after Rick told me that, I went back well, and Well, I told you, 
he told me that. So I said, I need to listen to this week's broadcast. Exactly. And that's why Rally TV is so important. Not only do we encourage you to watch it, we watch it as well. We go back and listen because we get encouraged what God said, what he's doing. So we want to encourage you to stay connected watching Rally TV. You can watch it on the Victory Channel, YouTube, or at, on our website at rallymen.org. You can watch current and previous episodes right there. Mm -hmm. Now, this is another thing. We've been getting a lot of you people who watch Rally mm -hmm. TV. You've been coming to our monthly meeting. Now, Nettie, I just had a meeting the other day with uh, our, our producer and I said, Mm -hmm. I feel strong in my spirit that we need to up, up our game uh -huh. concerning Rally LA. Amen. Rally LA is our monthly meeting in Hollywood, yes. California. God wants to up the game. Yes, and you know, Rally LA is a place that God has set us there in Hollywood, California. Mm -hmm. We encourage you to come. It is a place where if you don't know Jesus, you will meet Jesus. It's a place where we build your faith. Mm -hmm. And then number three, we are there to help and assist you with your assignment. We are all in assignment and Rally LA is the place where you will be encouraged with your assignment. Well, it's a place where dreamers gather. Exactly. People who have a desire <laughs> to do something for God. Yes. Now that sounds like me Oh yeah, and you. it does. Now also we wanna thank everybody, listen, we had somebody the other day <laughs> sow a, a seed uh -huh. into Rally TV Amen. because they were encouraged watching yes. Rally TV. What am I saying? Thank mm -hmm. you. Thank you for watching Rally yes. TV. Thank you for listening to <laughs> two believers yes. who literally take the word Amen. as it is mm -hmm. the authority and the words of God. Yes. And Nettie, let me finish with this. Mm -hmm. If it is working for us, we know yes. it will work for you. Exactly. And that's why that young man sowed that seed. Amen. It was a great seed. It was a blessing. Amen. But because he was touched. Mm -hmm. Listen, we want to thank all of you rally partners. Yes. Thank you. Thank you for partnering with mm -hmm. us. We take what you sow and we put it back into the ministry. Amen. We, we, uh, we do more television, we do outreaches, we do movies. Yes. So we want to say thank you. Ned, how do they become a partner? Yes, you could just go to rallyman.org and you can give. Once you give, you become a partner. We mm, pray for you. Yes. We connect you with our email list. You'll stay informed with what's happening. But most importantly, you are being prayed for every day by Rick and I. Every day, every mm. single day. And that's not some. That's not a cliche. No, it's not. I pray for our partners every day. Okay, yes. listen. We love you. We thank you for watching Rally TV. We call you blessed. Mm -hmm. In Jesus' name, Amen. Amen.